that baby. Purr. <laughs> Still going. Look at that. Awesome. Here we go. Yes. Got yeah, baby. I threw it right yes. in front of him. Earlier this year, I had the opportunity to go down to Florida, completely fish out of my element, catching all sorts of different types of crazy fish. And I've never had the opportunity to bring someone back up here and showcase the freshwater fishing that's available. So I was really, really excited and pumped to get Tyler up here and showcase our fishing. The cool thing about North American fishermen is we can go all over the country. Eric came down to Florida, my home turf, and uh, I put him on his first redfish, his first tarpon, and his first cobia, and a whole list of other species that we caught down there. And uh, after all that, you know, he offered to have me come up to Wisconsin and experience something new. And that's the thing, I've never caught any of these fish up here. A lot of species, a lot of big freshwater fish, and just a variety, something that was all new to me. Oh, there he is! Yeah! Nice! Sure enough, within five minutes, bam, he's hooked up, got his first big king salmon on. Feels right. pretty good on the crankbait, buddy. You got him on that flicker shed, don't yeah. you? Yeah. This big king salmon just grabs onto him and starts running all over the place. And I was like, oh my god, I could not believe how strong these fish are. Uh, they, they fight harder than a lot of saltwater fish that I'm used to. Awesome work, man. That's awesome. OK. See you, baby. It all comes down to this. Two knots enter, one knot leaves in the championship round of Knot Wars Light our returning winner, the Palomar Knot, facing off against its challenger, the improved reverse clinch.